Matt Coles ended his loan spell with Hampshire by taking the best match figures of his career of 10 for 154 as Essex were crushed by an innings and 31 runs in the afternoon session of the third day of their final LV County Championship match of the summer at the Aegeus Bowl. Essex began the third morning on 44 without loss after following on 249 runs behind and they lost wickets at regular intervals throughout the morning beginning with Jake Mukherbrough, who was LBW to Coles to the 11th ball. Four balls later, Gautam Gambier edged James Tomlinson to Liam Dawson, who took his 23rd catch of the championship season. And with a total on 69, Tom Wesley gave Michael Bates the first of his five catches of the innings, Coles with his eighth wicket of the match. Bates' second catch coming in the next over, as Greg Smith edged a good one from Tomlinson behind. Essex was staring at a very heavy defeat when James Foster was then bowled by Sean Irvin after offering no shot to leave with his side on 96 for 5. That left them still 153 runs behind and an innings defeat appeared a certainty even though Ben Folkes tried to delay the inevitable in partnership with debutante Kishan Vellani. His first game brought him 13 runs in the first innings and 9 in the second. He was then strangled down the leg side by Rule Brathwaite at 117 for 6. It was perhaps fitting that the innings of the day came from Graham Napier, who's had an outstanding all-round season. He decided that his final innings of the summer would be played in the same vein as many of his earlier ones. He began this season with a host of entertaining half-centuries and he was going to go out of the summer in the same way. Folks tried to join in, but in doing so, he nicked a pull off Coles behind to go for 27 at 156 for 7, the end nearly in sight. Bates' fifth catch of the day was his best, a terrific take off Sajid Mahmood's inside edge, which gave Tomlinson his third success of the innings. Napier was to end the championship season with 796 runs and 48 wickets, his 18th six of the summer carrying him to his 8th 50, of an impressive campaign. This one had come off 57 balls with seven fours and two maximums included. A misdirected flick off Tomlinson brought about his downfall. His wicket left Hampshire with just one more to get to secure their fourth victory of the championship summer. Monty Panasar now stood between Hampshire and that and he decided to have a bit of fun in what could be his final game in Essex colours. He has an important winter ahead as has Timon Mills, who also threw the bat, as the last pair stuck it out for 25 minutes, in which they added 30 runs for the last wicket. The fun was ended, rightly, by Coles, who bowled Panasar, before embarking on the kind of slide his kit cleaner would not have wanted to see. Coles ended with 4 for 83, for match figures of 10 for 154, his first ever 10-wicket haul, which took his tally of victims for Hampshire to 21 in his five matches on loan with them. Essex were all out for 218, and that meant a heavy innings and 31-run defeat and a third-place finish in this season's second division table. They ended 20 points off the promotion places. Hampshire took maximum points from this contest, and they will finish in fourth if Gloucestershire don't defeat Glomorgan on the last day of the season on Friday.